Hey, welcome back guys. So today on this video, we are talking about service agreements and more specifically, I'm going to quickly answer a question. I keep getting a lot on my other video and that is how do you create a service agreement in Square Invoices for free? So let's go ahead and talk about this. First off guys, real quick video, not too many steps involved. So be sure to stick around to the end of the video, but why would you need to create a service agreement anyways? Well, that's pretty easy. If you're running a business, you know that getting everything in writing up front is going to avoid a lot of headaches for yourself and for your customer. If there happens to be a dispute, whatever the case is, it's a pretty easy process and square invoices does offer a service agreement contract available for free here in their app. Check my video description. I'll try to leave all the written instructions there as well, but I'm going to go ahead and open my Square Invoices app. It's this blue and white one here at the top center. Okay, guys, I went ahead and opened up my Square Invoices app. This is the home screen. Now here on the home screen, if you want to create a service agreement with your Square Invoices app, all you need to do is click on this hamburger menu down here on the bottom right. These three horizontal lines, it's called more. Once you do that, you will see a drop down menu and you want to click on this line here called contracts. Okay, once you do that, you're going to see all the different contracts you might have already set up in your Square Invoices app. However, in order to set up a new service agreement contract, go ahead and click on this plus icon here on the top right. Okay, guys, once you do that, you're going to see all the various templates that are available in the Square Invoices app, but you want to scroll down until you see this one here called service agreement. Okay, guys, before we go any further, I want to let you know that this is not set up to be any kind of legal advice. So it's nice that Square Invoices makes available a service contract and service agreement for free. However, if you want another layer of protection, depending that on your type of business, uh, you might want to go ahead and talk to your attorney and that way they can look over the draft and see if it's something that's going to work for your particular business or your situation if you happen to have a dispute with one of your clients in the future. But at least this is a nice service agreement that's free and available on the Square Invoices. Now, in order to set up a service agreement in the Square Invoices app, first you have to add one of your customers as a recipient. So you want to click on this button here, add a recipient. Okay, once you do that, you're going to see all of your different customers inside of your Square Invoices. So just scroll through and then see who you're going to send the service agreement to. If that customer or client is not listed here, you can go ahead and click on this plus icon and then add that person as a recipient. For me, I'm going to go ahead and use this contact right here. Okay. Now we have added a recipient to our service agreement and next look down here, contract name, you can put service agreement, or for example, you can put the name of your company. So you can put Anthony service agreement and then additional notes down here. This is a description of what the service agreement is about. So you can go ahead and customize this to your business just by deleting this and typing it in. And now we're ready to go ahead and start creating our service agreement. So click on this blue next button here at the top, right? Okay. Okay, first, what you're going to do is you're going to go ahead and sign on behalf of your company. So for me, I'm going to go ahead and just type in your name. So I'm going to type Anthony. Okay, now it's processing. Okay, so now once you have typed in your name, then the contract preview for your service agreement is going to populate. So I'm going to scroll down a little bit. Okay, so as you can see, you can go ahead and scroll through this template for a service agreement. So it goes over the invoices, payment methods, no refunds, and then the recipient is going to have to initial here. This is going to be your customer or your client. And then it also discusses licensing, the authority to sign, termination of contract, modifications, and then down here is going to be the signatures for you, which have already signed, as you can see right here. And then also your recipient will sign here. So depending on your situation, this would initiate the service between you and your customer. So this looks pretty good to me. And again, like I said, you probably want to talk to your attorney just to make sure it's going to work for your particular business, but it's a good starting point. And then you'll just click on next here on the top, right? Okay. So here you can go ahead and share this service agreement with your client. So you can send it via email and then you can type in a message that they'll receive here and that way they receive the service agreement via email. If not, you can click here. Okay. Once you click there, now you can go ahead and download the service agreement from Square Invoices and that way you can have them sign it if they happen to be in your office or you can go ahead and share it to them through directly through your email as an attachment. And then you can also copy the URL and then text them the link and that way they can go ahead and sign it on their phone. So there you have it guys. If you're wondering how to set up a free service agreement using your Square Invoices app, that is the easiest way I know how to do it. If you know an easier way, be sure to leave a comment below. Let the rest of us know how you did it. Hopefully you found that video useful. If so, click thumbs up or maybe consider subscribing to my channel and I hope to see you on the next video. Thanks again for watching.